Snoring and sleep apnea is a life-threatening disease where the tongue is the main culprit. The tongue falls back and you end up stop breathing, whether from five times per hour all the way to 150 times per hour, and it affects the brain and the heart. You run a risk of at least 13 to 15 times uh, having have a stroke or a heart attack or falling asleep behind the wheel. So when that first came out, CPAP was a mask that they use. The problem with the, the CPAP, some folks don't want to wear it. I guess it's not too sexy when you have this mask. Uh, some folks, they think they're Darth Vader when they're talking uh, with this or sleeping with it. So bottom line, the second alternative would be the oral pliants. And that's when I come into the picture where they wear almost like a, a retainer. It fits over your top and bottom teeth and it moves your jaw forward. When you do that, you end up with actually the tongue being pulled mechanically by this oral device. So you end up with breathing much better and the snoring stops. I get referrals from physicians, sleep physicians, uh, that actually um, think that the patient would benefit more using the oral appliance rather than the CPAP.